Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi, and I say bye, Bitcoin, bye to the banks, guys. Yes, um, we are. We moved yesterday to a new place. You can see on the back uh, ground we have a new place. Um, this is the first time in our lives we need to move out of security reasons. And yes, that is the proof that when you get a little bit famous in a small niche market, um, some people will try to disadvantage of you. Or how do you say this? They, they, yeah, we need to move out of security reasons. So, but today a very cool, cool TA video with about five amazing charts that you need to see i'm going to tell you what exactly i see happening at the moment in bitcoin and i think it's very beautiful what i just saw so please watch the video till the end and and enjoy the charts over here we go okay. this is the first one guys this is the one hour chart that we um, shared yesterday in the video i told you guys you know there is a huge probability that we break the, the downside normally in these uh, uh in these patterns but i said let's stay positive let's move it to the upside now we broke out to the downside first over here that was a fake out we came back into the triangle again and then we broke out now the target should be around 53,000 US dollar. We didn't reach the 53,000 US dollar, we reached around like 51,600 US dollar. Um, yes, we can still go a little bit back and go up again. We don't know for sure, but this should have been the target uh, because it was a fake out first. Maybe the target is a little bit lower. This is uh, when you zoom in in the one hour chart. Okay. Now, if we zoom out a little bit, bam, over here, and we take it to the day chart, you see something very beautiful. This is that support line that we had since June, June 2021. You know, we found support on it. Here, this was the important moment, we broke it. And when we broke it, we fell down to this level over here. And uh, the wick went below it, but the body stayed above it, and the next wicks were exactly at the level. And why is that level important? Look, that's a 2.618 level. And if we zoom out, that is the level that we drew, Fibonacci level, to be very clear. Um, in the beginning of the year when we said this is the top this is the bottom so these levels will become important during this bull run and they became important look this blue level we broke it it became support the red level we broke it became support multiple times we broke downwards the blue level became support again and then you see we were fighting at red level we broke it and now that red level is again finding support look to the left it found one two three times support this is the first time support after breaking that level again so um for me very important level that 2.618 level around 47k guys now then guys and um, we can look at the bam bam indicator um, was the bam bam indicator calling this long and that short now the short was called over there after a long the long was not really long as the red line and everything was on top the bam was crossing down so the short was a valid short all the signs over there bam bam crossing over there now we have now the long here this area is where the candles close above the other stepping line also where the green is appearing also where the bam crossed the line that was a valid long and the long would have taken you now to like about five percent profit really could call on a four hour yes again in the one hour you can also use it and, and then you can for example use it for spot trading you don't need to leverage it you can also just buy and sell all up to you now we are going to zoom on a little bit more because this is the more important chart this is the weekly chart guys and on this weekly chart i want to show you something let's see where it is okay my face i will put my face over here now so it's very clear um on the weekly chart we see the whole pattern this is from 2012 and, and we can see we had like a top over there the top over there and um, we had the huge top over there in 2017 now we had a top over here and uh, we have a top over here a little bit but that's not really a top in my opinion but i will explain to you later why if you look to the rsi you know we found support over there we found support over there just in between the two tops two tops one two now here again this line is the support line in the rsi in 2017's bull run so we found support many times you see it every time on that line support and we had two huge tops that came above that green line one and two 
Now look to this year again. We have the support here, support there, support there, almost getting support there. This is the first stop. We are waiting for that next stop above there. And then the price would be higher than here. And now the beautiful part is that if we zoom in on that weekly chart, look what I'm going to show you, is that we had this huge pennant going on over here, you see? And we need to break that one. We came up, support line, came down, resistance line, and we fought it, fought it, fought it, and here we broke out. Now, if we extend that line a little bit like this, what do you see? The thing that I'm seeing now is that we found support. We retested that line. And mostly, when we break a line like that, and we find and retest that line, we go up from there. That is the normal pattern that you that happens after a retesting the line that we broke. So that is why I'm still very positive in this market. That plus also, of course, the other charts that I'm going to share with you now because I really like these as well. Keep on hanging. And one more, two more minutes, guys. Okay? Ah, bam, over here. This is the first one. A very important chart, I think. <clears throat> On this chart, you can see, guys, that um, look, every time when the, this is the, the, the funding rate of the futures. Now, every time when that goes negative, red, after the red part, we have this huge run in the Bitcoin price. Here, negative, huge run in price. We just went completely negative which in my opinion is positive we will see a little bit more negative period maybe a little bit like this and then we will have that huge run in the price really cool now on this chart you can see something really interesting as well i think it's very important because um i need to check if my face is in the right place because yes that yellow area that is illiquid so that's the illiquid bitcoin supply and that is now around like 14 and a half million. That means that 14 and a half millions of the Bitcoins, 14 and a half million of the Bitcoins, they are illiquid. They are not on exchanges. They are on hardware wallets, ledgers, all that stuff. Illiquid. The liquid part, the bluish ones and the highly liquid ones, these are on exchanges and can be traded or sold. But that in total is only like around 4 million. So we have 14 million illiquid, 4 million liquid, very positive in my opinion. Now, next chart, and this will be the bam, last but not least. This is the realized price of Bitcoin, um, which of course is also very important. Uh, the realized price, you can see also the downtrend, the uptrends, and the steep uptrends here, these colors. Now, every time in the bull cycles, you get these color combinations. You have the yellow one, that is like the slight uptrend, then you get the bull run, yeah, that is the steep uptrend, and then you get the bear market. We have the yellow one, we had that bull run there, we got a small bear market, but now we are again in that slight uptrend. And I believe that this will be followed up by a green area, just like we saw here in 2012 and 2013. Yellow, green, yellow, green. Can you see it? And I think that is going to happen again. Yellow, green. We had pinkish in between, and now yellow and green. So it's a combination of 2013 and 2017, in my opinion, guys. Now, bam, that was everything for today. Short video. I hope you really enjoyed it. If you did enjoy the video, give the video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment. What do you think about the video? And what do you think about my new view? Yes, it's not a sea view, but it's a beautiful garden with a pool. Um, and again, it's a little bit more safe, and that is what we were lo looking for as a family. Thanks for watching, and see you tomorrow again. Bam.